Sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. Here with Brittany Lincecum, a nice bogey-free day out there, the first round of the ShopRite LPGA. This is your 11th appearance here at CBO. That's it? Man, I thought yeah. it would have been like 20. <laughs> Just overall, what is it like coming back to this place mm -hmm. and being able to come out with a good start like today? Yeah, it's a, a place that I've won at before, so I have a lot of good memories and it's not a sh uh, long hitter's course really, it's kind of shorter, but you just gotta take advantage of the par fives. And it seemed like one of those really easy days where I couldn't do anything wrong. And I switched putters actually this week. Today was my first day, um, you know, tournament day and every like 50 footer, it felt like two footer, like every putt was going in. So it was one of those really easy days. So we'll see kind of how tomorrow goes, but hopefully with a new putter, the good vibes of a golf course that I've played well at before, and hopefully we can keep it going. What's it like to be able to kind of come back to a place where you've won before in this way and just feel comfortable? I know yeah. you're going through the changes, like you said, in your putter, but mm -hmm. to know that you're coming back to a course that you've done well at, I mean, it's got to give that kind of confidence this summer. Oh, for sure. They used to have our pictures kind of up on a, a board up here on the left of one, which was kind of cool just to kind of reflect on a good memory. And um, But it's great. You know, the ShopRite always takes care of us so well. Both my girls are here. We have a great time. We're staying down in Ocean City. We go to this little amusement park on the boardwalk almost every night and, um, you know, spend so much money just to let them ride rides but it's just a great place to be a great town to come to and uh, it's one that I normally don't try to miss so I'm shocked I haven't been here more hey they're lucky to have you every yeah. single time <laughs> um making it uh as you talked about kind of the changes of your putter but being able to hold those 50 footers what was yeah. maybe one of the longest putts out there today that you were able to get in shoot I mean it was probably 30 40 feet probably like and then even like 20 footers to save par like we're going in so um you know I'm happy that I switched is the Odyssey Jailbird. Um, you know, just it's just maybe one of those things where you just needed a change, yeah. and that was what I needed to kind of you know get over the hump of you know not playing well. And I feel like I've been so close the last couple weeks, you know, right on the bubble, missing the cut by one most weeks. Um, so it was nice to kind of get out there and, and to get around under par. Hopefully, we keep it going and uh, see what we can do in the next two days. And I feel like, do you ever feel like there's a little extra pressure out here being an assistant Solheim captain <laughs> and kind of like knowing that you have yeah. to watch out for other things that are going on in the course? Yeah, for sure. I mean, if it's not my two daughters at home, you know, being an assistant captain, there's a lot happening, but, and still trying to play good golf, you know, I'm obviously getting closer to retirement and, um, you know, just, I, I feel like I just, I still have it. I still feel like I'm that, you know, 19 year old that came out on tour 20 years ago now. I can't even believe I'm saying that. Um, but it's just so cool to be out here and to be able to keep playing a game that I love and, and having a good day. This is, this is wonderful. What I like about this course the most and that I like to pick people's brains about is the fact of the closing par fives on nine. And if you're finishing, on, if you're starting on 10, you're yeah. finishing on a par five. If, mm -hmm. you're, if you're finishing on 18, it's the same way. How yep. unique is that for this kind of event and also to have that as kind of a scorable, reachable chance? Sure. I mean, both were dead into today, so I wasn't sure I was going to be able to get to either one of them. Um, you know, but the last I got really close and the other one I was just like 20 yards short. Um, but just it, it is cool to have two par fives. Anything can happen coming down the stretch. I'm staring at a turtle right now. I think that was probably the highlight of my day. I was just watching all the turtles. They are so cute. I don't know if they're laying their eggs or what's happening, but um, it, it, you know, back to the par fives. It's, it's great to just anything can happen coming down the stretch, and I love that about the game. Yeah. All right, we might have to go save that turtle. So <laughs> thank know. you for coming in, Brittany. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I know, I